Hello and welcome to African Farming. Today we're going to be talking about parasites and the production losses they can cause on your farm. But I'm not alone. I'm with the awesome Doc Fafa Malan. Doc, welcome. Good morning, Tabi. So, Doc, let's talk about parasites. What are parasites and what different types of parasites do you get? Parasites are organisms, but they are on the outside of sheep and goats and cattle and even wild animals. But we also have internal parasites. And we've got examples, like for instance, roundworms. Let's talk about wireworm, which is also called barber's poleworm. And they live off blood. Then we have others like bankrupt worms. Bankrupt, you can go bankrupt yeah. if your animals have got different types of bankrupt worms. Nodular worm, it's also a round worm. And then we've got another group, the tapeworms. Now, for farmers, they think this is the most important parasite because you can see the segments, the white segments in the dung. And then we also got flukes, liver fluke and conical fluke. So, Doc, let's talk about how do you know when your animals has got a parasite, and especially an internal parasite, how do you know? Let's start with wireworm. It sucks blood. Now, you can think, if you haven't got blood, oxygen, your lack of oxygen, you can't walk far, you can even die if you've got a lack of oxygen. Then we've got the bankrupt worms. What will you see? Animals lose weight. And that's the first thing that a farmer sees. They become lean. They don't grow as they should. And they can also die. Then we have the other parasites that live of protein. And you know protein is so important for the immune system. So if you lack a good immune system, the animals get all sorts of diseases. So that's very important that your animal is in good condition. So Doc, prevention is better than cure. How do you prevent an outbreak of parasites on your farm? Now, first of all, if you only rely on drugs, that's only part of the solution. So first of all, weigh your animals regularly. If you see they're losing weight, then you know you've got a problem. If you look at the eye mucous membranes, you can see an animal should be reddish color. So if you see that some animals are becoming pinkish or white, you will know there's a problem. Some of these parasites even depress what we call anorexia. They don't eat as well as they should. So what will happen? They will lose weight. We get some parasites that cause a bottle jaw. That's a sac underneath the jaw. We think about wireworm. We think about liver fluke. But even other parasites can cause this bottle jaw. And then the most important thing is that some animals can live with parasites. We call that resilience. That doesn't mean that they haven't got parasites. But we also get animals that are resistant. They've got less parasites. So what do we say? It's the eye of the farmer that fattens the animals. So there are quite a lot of other things that we must look at. Rainfall. We must look at the pastures. Have we got, got enough food? But animals that are getting enough food are much more resistant to parasites. Look after your animals. Remember, we farm better together. Get 
get the necessary cover for you and your family in the event of unforeseen misfortune. The African Farming Protector Plan offers you comprehensive funeral cover for your entire family plus extended family at an affordable cost. Our product also offers benefits such as monthly discounts on groceries, discounted bus tickets, ambulance services, and trauma and assault assistance, to name a few. For more information on the African Farming Comprehensive Funeral Plan, SMS African Farming to 45269 and get the peace of mind you deserve.